Hello, my name's Cookie McJingles. That's Cookie with a K. I need to find a new job this Christmas because I got into a little bit of trouble at the North Pole. You know why? Because I was put in charge of what I put in Naughty Kids stockings this year. And apparently, coal fresh from the fireplace while it's still lit was frowned upon. <laughs> So, I have to find a new job, and maybe this website called BuzzFeed will help. It says, this Christmas quiz will determine your job in Santa's workshop. Are you the high elf in charge? No. I'm too mature for that, apparently. Okay, so, first question is, pick a Christmas movie. Christmas movie, Christmas movie. Ooh, I don't like the Grinch. There's no elves in it. Just those little who who's it? Elf? I can relate to Buddy. I'm an elf that's five foot eight and a half inches tall. Christmas Carol, no, it's too old. Oh the Christmas, I like Arthur Christmas. I can relate to the elf who can rap with only three pieces of tape. Count them. Three. But I can relate more to Buddy, so I'm going to go with Elf. It's Christmas food I am. Ooh, mac and cheese. I love me some mac and cheese. Pick a Christmas treat. Candy canes. No, I'm... I'm a candy caneaholic. So, no. Even the stripes in my jumper give me flashbacks. Oh, but I do like some hot cocoa though with gingerbread. Yum. Pick a Christmas drink. Hot chocolate or eggnog. I like me some hot chocolate. Mm -hmm. Pick a TV special. Christmas wishes on the office. No. It's boring. Who wants to find entertainment in an office? I tried that one. They kicked me out. Simpsons Christmas stories on The Simpsons. I like that. How the Ghost Stole Christmas on the X-Files. How the A Stole Christmas on Pretty Little Liars. Well, liars are on the naughty list. And I don't want any reminders from my old job. So, The Simpsons. Reindeer. Oh, great. Now you're my own species. You may not get enough recognition. Finally, it's been said that you're truly amazing. I already knew that. You're radiant and you brighten up the day. Yeah, well, I kind of did. The stockings would too if I had my own way. Okay, well, that was less than helpful. Let's find another one. Okay, this is more recent. What's your job at the North Pole? Are you in charge of wrapping the presents? I'd be good at that if they gave me a chance. Okay. Mrs. Claus has been trying out a new recipe. Taste one of them. No, thank you. I've had a cooking before. Um, hot chocolate. I like hot chocolate. And chocolate cake. I don't like donuts. They just, you know, they look Christmassy. But chocolate strawberries. Ooh. They don't grow them in the North Pole, though. So hot chocolate. Plenty of marshmallows. Thank you. You're being little bored. Little bored and bored all the time. What do you want to do? Play with the reindeer, play in the snow, do some crafts, have a snowball fight. Well, I would love to have a snowball fight, but do it with someone, I'm not saying who. It was me. We're not allow them anymore. Not since the head elf got frostbite in a certain place, which I can't see. In a naughty place. <laughs> Alright, damn, um, play in the snow. This is that as close as I'll get. <sighs> you want to watch a movie all the time. Which one will you choose? Elf, The Nutcracker and the Four Realms, It's a Wonderful Life, The Grinch. Again, I can relate a buddy, so Elf. Pick an activity to do. All of the above, decorate the tree, hang up the mistletoe, hang up some lights. Last time someone hung up mistletoe, human resources got involved. 
I know. Human resources for elves. <laughs> I like the hanging up lights. They're pretty. It's finally Christmas Eve. What do you want to do? Wrap presents? Eat Christmas food? Send Christmas cards? Watch Christmas movies? Well, leaving a little late on Christmas Eve, wrap presents? I'm insulted. Talk about last minute. Eat Christmas food? I wish I could do that. What my night off? Send Christmas cards again, last minute. Oh, I'm sorry. Watch Christmas movies, yes, I want something to do. Toy maker. You're in charge of making the toys. You're fun, festive and friendly. Good, someone tell my supervisor this. I need my CV written again. Alright, maybe there's another one. Let's just look for a few more. Okay, it's not work related, but we can have a bit of fun. And I might get some ideas too. Decorate a gingerbread house and we'll reveal which North Pole resident you are. Gumdrops, chocolate, what about coconut snow? Coconut, really? On Christmas? First, how big is your house going to be? Small, medium, large, I'm making a whole village. No, not that big. I'd love to though. I'll go for medium. What are you decorating first? The roof, the front, the yard, the doors. Always go with the roof. Start the top and work your way down. Which candy will you be putting on your house first? Gummy bears, candy canes, M&M's, jelly beans, red vines, skittles, starbursts or gumdrops? Well, as mentioned before, go away. I don't want a subscription. As I said before, candy canes, yeah, I'm still recovering. So, I know, gumdrops. Pick something else to add to your house. Cereal, gummy worms, marshmallows, Hershey's Kisses, Oreos, chocolate chips, candy bars, coconut shavings. Coconuts, really? Alright. I like marshmallows. I like marshmallows in my cocoa. I like them in my gingerbread house. <laughs> what makes your house special? It's filled with candy, Santa's sleigh is on the roof, there's a Christmas tree inside, it's life size, it's filled with presents, it has a giant garden, there's a snowman in the yard, it has a pool in the back. I love snow and even though I won't be able to lift a giant snowball and slam dunk it on the head elf, I can still make it into a great snowman. What do you do with your masterpiece? Eat it there, give it to my family, share it with my friends and family, Leave it up for decoration. What a waste. Share it. Sharing is caring. Mrs. Claus. Yeah. Santa. No. He's a great guy and everything, but he's not my type. You are truly the sweetest person in the North Pole. You make people feel safe and loved with your gentle demeanour. Yeah, tell the kids. Naughty kids that. <laughs> You spread the Christmas spirit all year long through kindness, generosity and warmth. <laughs> okay, in a desperate bid to help my elf esteem, let's try this one. Answer five questions and we will reveal which one of Santa's helpers you are. Just a warning, we made these all up. Yeah, great start already. Okay, choose a job. Reindeer caretaker, sleigh polisher, toy maker, toy designer, Mrs. Claus assistant, North Pole cook. Yeah, after the coal incident, I'm not even allowed near the oven, so that's out the window. Mrs. Claus, she's nice and all, but she's so boring. Toy designer, I could do that. Toy maker, maybe. Uh, I'll probably go crazy with the glitter. <laughs> Slate polisher? Nah. Reindeer caretaker? Hmm. 
I like animals. I like reindeer. I can relate a Rudolph so much. So, out of all of them, I think I'd be good at toy designing. I know what kids like. The good kid, that is. And I quickly learned that naughty kids don't like fire in their stocking. So, a toy designer. Choose a flavour of cookies. Snickerdoodle, peanut butter, gingerbread, sugar, chocolate chip or butter. I like butter cookies and I like chocolate chip. I think I'll go with chocolate chip. They're yummy. Choose a gift to get. New phone, plane ticket, concert ticket, new clothes, new shoes, gift cards. Gift cards are impersonal. New shoes? Perhaps if they got my size. New clothes? Hmm. Concert tickets? There aren't many bands I'd like to see live in concert. A plane ticket to anywhere in the world? I can use Santa's sleigh for that though. New phone? Yeah, that'd be great. New phone. Choose a new animal to replace reindeers. Dogs, zebras, ostrich, wolves, antelope, reindeers can't be replaced. These animals can't even fly. What are they talking about? Reindeers can't be replaced. My goodness. Oh, gumdrops. Choose a holiday food. Ham, mashed potatoes, stuffing, pecan pie, gingerbread cookies, mixed nuts. I do love me some stuffing. Yum. What? Who's he? Bushy Evergreen? You're the skilled engineer of the group. Okay. I think. Bushy Evergreen? They did say they made him up, but really? An engineer? So we do have engineers for the toy wrapping part. Mm. And machines. And the oven, because um, someone may have put the casserole in too long. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Buddy, I can relate to so much. He's a tall elf like me. What percentage Buddy the elf are you? Ooh, check off all that apply. Like a CV, you love Christmas. I do. In fact, it's your favourite holiday. It is. And you love Christmas more than anyone you know. Not entirely true. Santa Claus is definitely real. Oh yes, 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 yes. He's mad at me most of the time, but yes, he's definitely real. As is his rage. Santa, yep. You get annoyed when people say there was no such person as Santa Claus. Oh, all the time. <sighs> you are obsessed with all things sweet. Mainly peppermint flavours. You could mix candy with any food and it would taste good. No, not really. You dressed up as an elf before. I'm already an elf. Does that count? I'm in my uniform. And this, this is just informal accessorizing. Okay, sure. <laughs> You're always happy. No. You have a resting happy face. No. Winter is your favorite season. It is. You'll start planning for Christmas in November, I do. You start planning for Christmas in September. Yes. You seem to always be planning for Christmas. Not that much. You listen to Christmas music year round and have no shame about it. <laughs> I started in July. You may not be a good singer, but you sure do battle it out when it comes to Christmas music. Not really, no. I forget half the lyrics most of the time. After all, it's the best type of music out there. It is. You are tall compared to all your friends. Only my entire life. You are not easily angered. 
Only Bylanol it gets. When people insult you, we tend to just feel bad for them. No, I just say something else back. That hits them right here. You get scared by little things like Jack in the Boxes. Who has them anymore? Ugh, they're so 19th century. You love animals, I do. Except sometimes I don't seem to like you very much. I'm insulted. Sometimes you talk to animals, I do. You love revolving doors, no. You have or would ruin a revolving door until you puked, no. No, 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 no. That's a bad idea. Very, very bad idea. Can you imagine all the candy cane flavoured vomit you would admit? Ew. You are always the first to congratulate someone when they do something well. I do. I'm a good elf that way. You gravitate towards anything festive. Yeah. <laughs> you love winter activities such as skating and making snow angels, and a telegraph band, snowball fights. <laughs> Escalators front you sometimes. No, I love them. They're better than revolving doors. You love giving gifts. I do. You like giving gifts better than getting gifts. You always get the biggest Christmas tree. Well, compared to the other elves, they always have a big Christmas tree. That way, you can fit as many ornaments and lights on as possible. No, not really. Your house always needs to be decked out with Christmas decorations all the time. You rarely ever swear. True. And when you do, it's mostly phrases like, son of a nutcracker. No. Festivity is practically your middle name. Cookie, Festivity, McJingles. Doesn't. Roll off the tongue as, as as good, does it? Because there's no one more jolly than you. That's true. What are my results? You checked off 21 out of 39 on this list. 51% buddy. Okay, so I'm 51% buddy. And 49% not buddy. I'm happy with that. There can only be one buddy, and there can only be one Cookie McJungles, and that's me. <laughs> Have yourself a merry little Christmas, and be good, or I'll put coal in your stocking. Don't tell the head elf that, but I will. And I may or may not get it fresh from the fireplace, if it's still on. <laughs> merry Christmas. <laughs>